Welcome back to Wallpapering Things That Aren't Walls, part two. Last week I decided that my toddler's standing tower stool wasn't cute enough, so I wallpapered it. Today I'm adding a wallpaper to disguise the warped part of this old cabinet. Sadly, when the light shines right on it, you can see the warped ridges. So I decided to add wallpaper to the back, but in a temporary way so that we can swap out the pattern later on. I used foam poster board and measured the sections in between each shelf since these shelves were stuck in there. And once the back was covered in poster board, I started wallpapering. I added an extra inch for each piece so that I could cut the edges perfectly with an exacto knife after I applied it. I started applying section by section and it was surprisingly a very quick process. I smoothed out all of the bubbles with a card from my wallet and I love that you can't see the warp section anymore. 